What's up, people? This is Matt from remove-malware.com, and uh, tonight, since I'm too busy tomorrow, I'm going to go ahead and do the F, uh, F Secure Internet Security 2009 review. Um, basically, most of you guys already know that this is a highly infected virtual machine. It's got tons of uh, malware, <clears throat> tons of it. Uh, over a thousand infections. So we're going to see how um, F-Secure does. The F-Secure installer is um, 84.2 megabytes. It's gigantic. Huge. Uh, the biggest installer I've dealt with yet. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and get installing it. It looks like an MSI. <coughs> Excuse me, I've been in a party all night. <clears throat> it sucks, I always have to do these reviews after a big party. Alright. Let's go ahead and select, select uh, English language. Accept my uh, license agreement, basically. I'm not going to do a subscription key. I'm just going to try to evaluate. I'm going to say 30 days of F-Secure Internet Security 2009. I'm going to go ahead and skip the update. I do not have my network card turned on at this point. Um, you can see it's off down here. We're going to do an update later on. I'm going to do a step-by-step -step installation, uh, full installation, uh, choose my path, and, and F-Secure is really crazy about conflicting products, and that's basically what this says right here, detecting conflicting products. And uh, I, I know there are no conflicting plot, uh, products on this computer because... Uh, uh, it's uh, antivirus free, let's just say that. <clears throat> so while this is installing, I'll go ahead and do my uh, usual announcements thing. Uh, I'm doing about one review a week, and um, sometimes I do a poll, sometimes I don't. I get tons and tons of email, uh, YouTube comments, uh, invitations, personal messages, all that stuff, and like sometimes I'm a day or two late, so don't become offended or anything. I'm only one guy uh, doing this for free, and I have no help or anything, so. Uh, again, I'm not being paid by anybody, I'm just curious to see how uh, every piece of uh, anti-malware works. Does it, does it actually do its job? Um, I have a business in St. Louis, and whenever I go out and see a client, I need something that works and works fast, gives me a great result, and gets me in and out of a job. So that's why I'm doing this. So there you go. So while this is installing, I'm going to select some new music here. Uh, let's see. Let's kick on some Primus. <clears throat> These videos will be broken up into uh, ten minute. 10 minute segments for uh, YouTube. Uh, basically, do like an install, uh, configuration video, and then a scan and a conclusion. And uh, I have to say this every time because you never know when someone new will look at a video. And I know a lot of people who already look at my videos get pissed off that I say this, but I don't know what to tell you. I always get new people every day.
tons and tons of fake pop-ups. Don't you hate that fake anti-malware crap? I hate it. The only thing worse than that is a friggin' rootkit. All I do is deal with rootkits now. It sucks. Extra time. Just take forever. Unless you have a bootable CD. Then they're toast. So F-Secure is taking its time here. So, you know, what do you expect? It's an 82, 82 uh, megabyte uh, installer. I started this video at uh, 10.59. Just uh, 11.05. Got a few more minutes here before I have to pause it. Tons and tons of uh, fake pop-ups down here and tons of uh, bullshit redirection going on. Insecure internet activity detected. Threat of a virus attack. I feel sorry for these poor people who uh, get subjected to this crap and they fall for it. I've had a few clients fall for this and get their entire identity stolen. Uh, just for registering for a fake program. Uh, it's just unbelievable. So uh, F-Secure seems to have kind of stalled uh, the installer here. I don't mean to bore everyone with this, but this is the kind of uh, crap that you would face if you were installing this on an infected computer. Well, I have no choice but to pause it right now. I'll be back.